Few tales are told of Hades, whose very name inspires fear and penitence, reminding us of the inevitable fate which we all share. I, however, mean to tell you such a tale. Listen carefully. Goodbye, Father. What the hell with this place? She is. It's got to be her. Then here goes nothing. <clears throat> In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hail, noble cousin. Now, let's get you from that miserable place. I'll see that all of us upon Olympus do our part, beginning here with me. Hear me all the way where you are, goddess, but thank you. <laughs> Who dies first? Crushed. this. I'm hurt. Can't heal myself, but I can fight.
of power. The power of the gods. I'm home. <clears throat> yes, carry on, everyone. Don't mind me. <sighs> Welcome to the House of Hades, where... Wait, I know you. Guess that means you died out there, huh? Well, don't be sad, though. Pretty much everybody dies sometime. Some of us more than others. Back already. Stupid boy. I told you nobody gets out of here, whether alive or dead. Though how is your wanton ransacking of my domain? Greetings, Father. My ransacking was a delight, thank you for asking. So I'll just be on my way again. Be on your way indeed. What do I care? You shall never reach the surface. Go, see for yourself. There's a good boy. Do not let him manipulate you, Cerberus. You have come home. Do not despair, child. Such setbacks are inevitable and may be overcome with effort and with time. You made contact with the goddess Athena. She shall be true to her word. I believe it, Nex. I'm grateful that you put us into contact. I know you took a considerable risk in reaching out. The risk is not to me. I expected the Olympians would involve themselves in this eventually. Reveal to them no more than they already know. Are we understood? Yes, we are. Then go. You've returned. Good to see you, lad. Despite the circumstances. Remember your training out there. The pain of death is but another obstacle. And fear is for the weak. Take care, Achilles. The House of Hades. That dark and lavishly appointed lair of the Underworld's king is home not just to him, but to his willful progeny. You know I can hear you, old man. If I sit down, I won't want to get back up.
Hey, room. I'm back. Night and darkness guide me. The bedchambers of Prince Zagreus lie in a perpetual state of utter disarray, despite his lord and master of the house repeatedly insisting that he pick everything up. Oh, come on, it's not that bad, is it? Who needs sleep? Okay. Need to find a key. There we go. Cora locked. The heart seeker. Let's deal some death. Psst, over here. What the? That's the spirit. You got here, boyo. Name Skelly. How's it going? But enough with the small talk already. I'm here to do a job. So let me have it. Give me it. I don't remember having you on payroll, mate. Who's your supervisor? Oh, I'm not about to wrap my sources, pal. Just try and beat it out of me. If you insist. That's just the... ah! Oops. <laughs> my blade. You're pretty good. Again. Thunder. Is that... Is this really him? Okay. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather difficult, and he's not so much as called in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing. Lord Uncle Zeus lending his support. Never thought I'd see the day, or night, whenever. Yeah. 
having a good time? Well, sure then. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I'll accept this message. Hey there, Zag man. How's it going? Look, you have got to get here with the rest of us already. We've been saving you a spot. Let me see what I can do. Make life a little sweeter for you in the meantime. to liven things up around here. Got me. No way to patch up. Got to keep going. Each exit has its own reward. They absorb my blow.
last one was bound to show up, I guess. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. You've got quite the fighting spirit in you there, I have to say. Most intriguing, and yet no surprise for someone born in hell itself. You come on out of there and tell me all about it. I'm a fellow student of death, you see. means war. Farthest I've come. Got to be. Then, in the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hoy there, little Hades. You recognize your uncle, do you not? We have a lot of catching up to do, but first things first. You get yourself out of that dour underworld. As for me, I'll see if I can stir things up a bit to cover your advance. Looks like I caught a big one. The power of the seas should be of help. See you, Charon, mate. Just minding my own business, taking in the sights, and hey, what's that you got? Some sort of wares for sale? And I'll just have a look around. Cheers, mate. The infernal wares of the Stygian boatman Charon lie sprawled about. Available for sale, Doomever would be willing to quench the boatman's great thirst for riches. That would be me.
I'd like to think I learned something back there. <laughs> Looks like one of the wretched witches shot you dead last time. Sorry to hear that, huh? Have you tried shooting them first? I haven't. Someone's at the desk next to the throne. Surprise, Hypnos. I got you this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't bring that in here. Eh, just kidding. Thanks. But wait, I'll trade you. Look. Cheers, Hypnos. Who's that sniveling shade to your immediate left there, father? Already found someone new to do the busy work. And here I thought I was utterly indispensable. That shade, boy, is my newly designated contractor. One whose responsibility is to work on this house. Though who shall pay for everything my subjects here demand, I do not know. You're trying to guilt me into funding the exorbitant furnishings you desire. Perhaps once we are finished with repairs for all the carnage you have sown throughout my realm, then we might finally have time for all the needed renovations that have piled up. Nice. Not everybody knows exactly how to give you pets and live to tell of it, right, boy? Oh, please. Some sort of special offer for me, my good shade. Work authorized. A fountain chamber in the depths of Tartarus sounds like an excellent idea. What's that there? Something from the fates. Darkness guides you, child. You have outgrown this house. Of that I am now certain. Should you return again here, I shall keep you safe. I won't forget you, Nyx. I swear it. Keep at it, lad. I've known great men throughout my life, and I can always tell when someone's better than their circumstances. Fight like I'd fight out there. I'll give them hell as you once did, Achilles. Though, doubtless, many of the shades who stand against me first arrived in Tartarus because of you. What once was a small lounging area within the House of Hades, now is sealed off in utter shambles since the multi-headed Cerberus tore the space apart, warning the missing prince. Cerberus destroyed the lounge again. How am I looking? How's it going? What's the good one? You're pretty quick, you know, boyo. Just be sure to use that fancy dash of yours and keep him guessing. Don't let him catch you standing still. Dash like mad instead of standing still. That's not the worst advice, I guess. Open up. 
Aegis, shield of chaos, lend me your power. Hey, that looks pretty mean. yet. going to want all this. Let's see here. Hi there. 
In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Why, hello, hello there, little godling. I have to say, you're quite the specimen, and so I've decided I shall aid you for the moment. You interested? Interested? And the power to break hearts? Not sure I don't see why not. to unlock a weapon. Ah, oh, what I wouldn't give for, say, a healing flask of some sort.
it this far. No urns permitted in this chamber. Pleasure doing business. Fine day to you as well there, mate. Now let's have a look at your supplies, shall we? Well, this is awkward. <laughs> halt, Sagrius. Not one step further. Come on, Meg. Haven't we had more than enough of each other by now? Besides, don't you have someplace else to be? Your father sent me. All in all, I'd rather be on your bad side than his. Now you can turn back, like a good little man, or I can send you home the painful way. What'll it be? I'll have to go with the painful way. A man after my own heart. Cheers for that, Meg. Whoa! Oh, wow! So Megara herself got you last time. That must have been intense. She's fast and strong and beautiful. And, um, anyway, I hope the fates are nicer to you next time. Yeah, I hope so too. Any wiser yet. How goes it? You'll get the hang of it out there, lad. For all our sparring practice, there's no teacher like the real thing. Now then, I have something for you. What, wait, you're giving me your codex? I can't accept something like this. Please, I insist. I want your love of history to grow, not just your love of warfare. Besides, maybe you can finish out the rest of it. I'm grateful. Father's chambers, always locked. Stay out of there. Father, what happened to the lounge? The only place for anyone to have a little fun around here and you seal it shut. Oh, I had little choice about that boy. You see, after you fled the first time, Cerberus, why, he was very much upset. Utterly tore the place to shreds. It's now under repair. All thanks to you. You're really blaming me for not minding the dog while I was out and while you all were here. I lay the blame entirely upon you, yes. Who else? It's fortunate that Cerberus has calmed himself since then. Come to his senses, I should say. May you yet come to yours. <laughs> Infernal watchdog Cerberus regards the underworld prince with mixed emotions, from purest joy to deepest melancholy. You watch over things for me, won't you, boy? You know I'd take you if I could. Here, boy. Just as long as one of your three heads enjoys these pets. entirely of gemstones. 
There is no setback which you cannot overcome. Bye, Nix. different. Hey. Hey, yeah. Got something new to try. Might help. Let's see what's in here. Baratha. The Eternal Spear. Join my pursuit. Time to give that thing some work, I guess. is kept neat and orderly, in contrast to the terrifying sprawl that lies beyond. It's not that orderly, really. A divine arrow. There's only one heavenly archer I know of. Well, several, really. Anyway, in the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. I heard about you. Look, I'm not like all the others on Olympus. The power of the hunt helps keep me company, so maybe it'll help you too. Sounds like good company to keep. going through your head. I mean, I know you hear me and the others, but it's so damn dark down there, I can't hear you at all.
be the fountain chamber I commissioned back at home. Hit the spot. A place of calm and respite. Whilst perhaps unimaginable in the underworld, occasionally is to be found, in fact. And not a moment too soon. <laughs> 